Hello, this is Late Night Games. Uh, taking a break from Persona because that game is sad, and I don't feel like being sad right now. So I'm playing Dishonored for a little while. I'll be uh, switching on and off which game I'm playing, you know, just depending on the day, I guess. Uh, I have played this and finished it on Low Chaos before. I'm gonna try to go the pacifist route again. Uh, it might involve me <laughs> saves coming a little bit, because, uh, your boy's a coward. Uh, we will go normal. Uh, that's fine. And away we go. You have just returned from a journey of several months, visiting the other nations in the Empire to ask for aid in dealing with the Rat Plague. You must deliver their diplomatic response to the Empress, whom you serve as Lord Protector. Corvo, if only there was someone else I trusted to send, so that you could remain near. But there is no one else, and the Spymaster was right to insist that I send you. The plague has taken so many, and we must find a cure. When you are near, my heart is at peace. Emily and I will count the days until you return. Hurry home, and bring good news. Only the best news. Steady hand! That's it! Watch it! Uh, I will also be going down Passing on. Dishonored 2 We're away. and Death of the Outsider uh, once we get to that point. Take us straight to Dunwall Tower. Lord now, Corvo has news for the Empress, and we've come a long way. A long way to bring bad news. The sailors say there's a curse on us. Black magic. No such thing. Superstition. For all we know, there's a cure for the plague by now. Exactly. Maybe. We live in strange times. Sending Doctor the Empress's strange. bodyguard away for a couple of months. That's unusual. Dishonored the multiverse of madness could We need help with the rat plague. Well, oh, I'll also be doing the DLCs after, well, the two story DLCs, not the Dunwall Trials, because those are stupid, Paul stupid there. idiot babies. I'm playing on PC. You good, dude? Corvo, she's waiting. You it's should go see traveling the Empress. with you, Corvo. You having fun? Oh, there you go. You got it. I always, I always believed you. Uh, what was I saying? Oh yeah. So I am playing you know what to do next time? on the PC. Yes. Yes. But I'm using the gamepad. Pressure was too low. Controller. All these new machines are touching. Uh, I don't like using Just keyboard mouse. Do I think I said that in Persona. I'm saying it again here. Hello, sir. I will never not say it because fuck Corvo, keyboard you're mouse. Back. Will you tell me about your trip, please? Were there any whales? Yeah, there was a dead Wait. one on the ship. Let's play hide and seek first. I'll cover my eyes and you hide. You have time? Mother's busy talking to that nasty old spy master. Okay, go on. Okay, here we go. <laughs> Can you just leave her? Just like right away? Ooh. I guess I won't. I didn't tell her I would play hide and seek, and you should never lie to children. That's a joke. You should always lie to children. They deserve it. <laughs> Let's see if you're still good at this. I'll hide my eyes and count, and at the end of the countdown, I'll try and find you. 
Okay. I'm going to count to ten. Find a place to hide. Enter stealth mode. Yeah, yeah, I know how to stealth in this game. I beat it before. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, Me. ten. Here I come. Me. Let's see about here. Stupid! Stupid, I'm over here! Oh, you kids find me? Oh, are you stupid? Oh, oh. Where are you? Where, where, where are you, my girl? Okay, you win. We should go now, so Mother can see you too. And uh. expose my hiding place? Dude. Everyone seems scared because of the rat plague. I'm glad you're here. Yeah, yeah, I know. I'm the greatest. Welcome home, Lord Protector. Stop moving, Campbell. And you, Corvo, welcome back. From wherever you've been. They sent him all around the Isles to beg for aid. A waste of time. My elixir will banish the plague from this city. Now keep still a moment, High Overseer Campbell. Oh, I just realized I'm, I'm not playing so this sure at that a painting bad looks like Campbell. Time, huh? <laughs> Good thing there's no such thing as as plagues in the real world, right? Hey yo. Corvo, please. I can't see him. I want my own painting, bitch. Gentlemen, I cannot paint without your cooperation. It was a fool's errand, Corvo. I the plague comes from inside us. We must all strengthen our faith. You saw my improvements to the waterlock. Oh, I didn't know you could get annoyed enough to just stop painting. I knew you could take that and comments on it, but I guess because I took it while he was annoyed at me. Things are bad. Doesn't do it. She'll see you at once. Never doubt it. Why should I sprint? Fashion this sick people, child. Not criminals. We've gone beyond that question, Your Majesty. They're they're my citizens, I can't see. and we will save them I from the plague see. if we can. All of them. I can't Very see. well. We will not speak of this again. Mother, Corvo is back. Thank you, Emily. Uh, Leave us, please. As you wish, Your Majesty. Uh. Hmm. You were gone. Mother seemed very sad. Uh, okay. I so I just you. loaded an auto save. Hopefully, I don't. Follow me, Corvo. Disappear again. If I disappear, I mean out of this plane of existence, because apparently that's a secret power Corvo had. Welcome home, Lord Protector. Yes, 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 yes. I'm not so sure that painting looks like Campbell. Oh, he looks the same to me. His smug aura mocks me. My what are you doing? I need the bottle to draw the eye away from Campbell. I suppose I can paint him without the cider. Huh? Though in truth, he is always close to this stuff. Well, I mean, it looks pretty much done for me. You... You could probably just leave it as it is. Or just get a new cider, Jesus. That battle. She'll see you at once. Loser. Alright. Okay. Is he gonna glitch out again? Or am I allowed to watch? They're sick hey. people, not criminals. We've gone beyond that question, your majesty. They're They're my citizens. And we will save them from the plague if we can. All of them. Very what a nice well. lady. I hope nothing we will bad not happens. Speak of this again. To her. Mother, Corvo is back. Thank you, Emily. Leave us, please. As you wish, Your Majesty. Corvo. Two days early. Full of surprises. As usual. 
What a nice looking man. Not suspicious in any way. Am I right, Lady Emily? Follow Who is me. definitely... It's a fair wind that brings you home to me. Not what news daughter, have you brought? Corvo's daughter. Whatever. Want me to pull your finger? Everyone seems scared because of the... Alright, here you go. I hope that one of the other cities had dealt with this before. Knew of some cure. This news is very bad. We're at the breaking point. Cowards. They're going to blockade us. They'll wait to see if the plague turns the city into a graveyard. Are you okay, Mother? You seem sad. Yes, don't, don't listen worry, her? darling. The world's gonna die. Mother the is city's fine. gonna die, rather. Wait, where are the guards? Who sent them away? Mother, look! What are they doing on the rooftop? What? Emily, come here! And I'm pretty sure this is the only time that like, lethal force is allowed without Emily, any punishment. Look out! Another one! <laughs> Corvo, thank you. If you hadn't been here... No more! Not again! Mommy! No! Get away from her! I'm pretty sure magic still doesn't exist. Corvo, it's all coming apart. Find, find Emily. Protect her. You're the only one. You'll know what to do, won't you, Corvo? Always. Ward us all. Look at what he's done. Yes, he's killed the Empress. Definitely. What did you do with young Lady Emily, traitor? I Her own bodyguard. Not... Ironic. I'll see you beheaded for this, Corvo. Peg him. Bitches. Six months have passed since you were accused by the royal spy master of murdering the empress and conspiring to abduct her daughter, Emily, the royal heir. Now locked away in Cold, Cold, Coldridge Prison, the time of your execution draws near. Chance, Corvo. Sign the confession and let me give you the rights to put your spirit at ease. Make me. That's enough for now. Get out. Let's give the man some time to think. Corvo, the Empress is dead. Her daughter Emily is hidden away, and no one will ever know the truth. Yes, I'm unlucky you. Tomorrow you'll be executed, but it's for a good cause. This country needs strong leadership now, someone to guide the weak. And that's where we come in. There was nothing personal in this, even though you almost sank our plans. But it turned out well. You were in the wrong place at the right time, and someone has to take the fall. Bitches. Goodbye, Corvo. God! Take him back to his cell. So what you see in there is uh, called the main crux of the plot. We've been dishonored. You should eat, Corvo. Seen this meal comes from a friend. By being accused of killing Empress, who's like a good Empress. She's a nice, very nice lady. And then, and then we're being framed by the by the royal spy master. And that is the 
in-depth tutorial on the intro to this game. You're welcome. Don't have to w uh, watch anybody else play it ever again. You're welcome. Anonymous message. Corvo, who we are is irrelevant right now. Just know that we have faith in you. Here's the key to your cell. Once you're out, head for the prisoner interrogation room. Yeah, take the explosive there and plant it on the outer door. Yeah, when the bomb goes off, run. Make for the river and lose yourself in the sewers. Uh, you'll find some useful gear stashed there. Uh, one of the prison guards will leave a weapon just outside your cell. Uh, and good luck. We need you alive and well for what's to come. A friend. Let me know if you want to gamble on the hounds again, please. Not now. Joke's on you. I refuse. A oh, so many people. Save, save, save. Always save. Come and be executed. It's on account of Corvo, the one who killed the Empress and abducted her daughter, Emily. Allegedly. So it's an occasion. Right. A social event for the High and Mighty. Come see the noble Lord Protector get his head chopped off. Allegedly. You're as bad as us betting on the dogfights. Attention. The solitary wing is off-limits to maintenance crews, unless accompanied by an officer of the watch. Escort through the solitary wing must be scheduled in advance, with one week's notice. I'm going to put this... I'm uh, pretty sure... Ah. You're out. Nice Good work. work. Get a Cut few more throat. before they get you. That counts as a spot. I don't think it does. <coughs> See? <coughs> ha! Good for you. I hated that guy. Slackjaw, I'm in here. He's got to get me out. What's your name, friendo? Let me out. I've got Attention. three days before they Tomorrow's cut my head execution off. will be restricted to the I'll personnel assigned to the event and approved dignitaries only. Thinking weapons. I'm a god. I'm a gamer. I'm a gamer god. Nope. Not even grab the pistol. Nothing. Give me a gosh diggity darn ghost. If you know what I'm saying. Nothing in there. I think it's mana. <laughs> Not that magic's real, of course. 
Just like if I had mana. There's an upgrade where you can. I think. If I remember right. Do do do. Do 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 do. Do 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 do. Do 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 do. Attention, the solitary okay. wing is off limits to maintenance crews, unless accompanied by an officer of the watch. Escort through the solitary wing must be scheduled in advance, with one week's notice. You can have a good old sleepy time right today. No. No. Right, right there. See, he just got drunk and fell off of his chair. I don't trust them not to see you right now. Actually, no, I, I lied. I just want to put him in this box. Oh! oh. oh. I didn't do it. I didn't do anything. You can't prove it. Save game. Interrogation. Corvo Tano, formerly the Royal Protector, will be brought in for interrogation. This is of utmost importance. The Lord Regent and High Overseer Campbell will conduct the questioning themselves. Follow their orders without hesitation and keep the torturer under control. If Corvo dies in his hands, instead of getting the public execution the Lord Regent wants, it'll be your head that goes next. Corvo's unconscious again. Though he's taken more punishment than in two men we've brought in for interrogation. When he wakes, we'll start again. Having him sign the confession for her murder isn't critical, but it might be useful to us later. The assassination of an empress is not a trivial matter. Where does the sound come out? Like, that's where you speak into it. Is that the sound hole? I guess. Hmm. Carnage. Bottles. Someone out Personnel here. assigned to the event and a far away dignitaries only. Out here. Ackworth, you lazy slug. Did you patrol the yard? Sorry, not yet. I was gonna report that boiler leak from yesterday. Forget it. Just do your rounds. The report's trouble from both of us. I'm moving. Is there only two people? I swear there was three. I'm gonna save a lot here because I always huh? used to get cut. Like that. Nothing after all. No, this is just ridiculous. 
stupid rats. Put. Attention. The solitary wing is off limits to maintenance crews, unless accompanied by an officer of the watch. Escort through the solitary wing must be scheduled in advance with one week's notice. I'm just gonna put me in this chair. There was like a sneakier way to get out than blowing a hole in the door. You know what I mean? I feel like the rest of this game is all about the choice of being loud or not. Feels like missed opportunity to have like a oh you could be being explosive. You could do something else. Cold shoulder. Attention. Tomorrow's execution will be restricted to the personnel assigned to the event and approved dignitaries. <sighs> Who can is tomorrow? I... Yeah, but everything has to be set up today. I can't wait to see his head roll. Not everyone did, but I really like the Empress. So there's a few ways to go about this. There's the ultra sneaky way, which is to say, probably the best way. Or there's the way you say your sister was? that I shut did. up. Which is to uh, kill everybody, and by kill everybody, I mean knock everybody out because that's the low chaos path. Uh, but I guess I'll mix it up today and go the quote unquote best way. I don't know if it's actually the best way, but it's the way that I assume is like. <laughs> the best ish. Although I don't know. Sorry, just had to move my mouse out of the way. <laughs> I'm a safe scummer. What if I do this? What if I... What if I... What if I do this? Oh, no. Stupid goddamn. That was so hot. Say in the dumpster. I'm pretty sure that they die if. That's not what I want. Oh. Okay. Um. Can I pick him up? Oh god. I'm so sorry, sir. No! 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 <laughs> uh. Okay, now I just. I, I can't think of anything. Alright, that's fine. I don't care. I don't care. Both of you down there. Go like this and 
Uh, close that. So you stop doing that. Uh, you know what? They found the bodies. All right, let's go back here. <laughs> oh, hey, I'm further behind than I thought I was going to be. Okay, that's fine. Oh, excuse me. Oh, well, I found it anyway because I don't know where else huh? I guess I guess in there maybe because I don't want them to be found and I don't want to get seen so I'm gonna try doing this quick to save the game here If those guys have not died, which is the ideal situation, and then this is the play. These guys will get all. Save it like this. Just to see. If he comes back, these guys, I'll earn another promotion. This guy's not unconscious, it says. Okay. Okay, hold on. So I moved them to this spot next to the door. I feel like they. Hold on. 
sorry, I've been uh, sneezing a lot, I'm just trying to make sure that gets cut out. Uh, I feel like this is not a good hiding spot, and that they're gonna see it. But I don't know where else to hide, because they're not making this easy for me. They're not making this easy for a little lad like me. Uh, I hope this works. Let's see. Okay, but here's the thing. They said, like, what the, what the? Eyes peeled. But I don't know if that's because they saw a body, or if that's just because. I gotta stop Giraffe. Nothing here. I guess. All out if you see it. Is he gonna see it? He's looking right at him. We you know you're here. How did I lose it? So so far, it looks like they have not seen those guys somehow. So. I am booking it. Look shot. We got a prowler. <clears throat> okay. Okay, I think I did it. I think I did it. I think I did it. And this time, I didn't actually pick up one of their swords, so I'm still stabby free. I mean, not that having a sword makes me stabbing people, but still. Stab free. The outsider walks. Do, 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 do. That's a relevant meme still, right? I smell a trap. Huh. Huh. Alright. He used some kind of explosive to blast his way out. That doesn't happen by accident. You think he had help? Note from a friend. Corvo. Yeah, Corvo. If you're reading this, it means our plan works. And you're broken free from Coltridge. Uh, one of our contacts has hidden weapons from you somewhere deeper in the sewers. Uh, grab the gear and find Samuel where these tunnels dump out in the river. Uh, he will bring you to us. Uh, a friend will meet you soon. I don't know how to do that. Final Street gang, maybe. Watch for booby traps. There'll be some down here by the look of me. Good. If we're lucky, one of them will get Corvo. You're afraid of him? <laughs> He's Sir Conan. It's all merchants and whores down there. Kids like you, you never saw what he was like. Huh. I saw him fight three to one in the oh. practice yard. He's a whirlwind. Watch out. Whirlwind. I hope it's me that finds him. I hope it is too. Oh, shit. Yeah, I'm in stealth mode, my guy. Oh, they seem friendly. I have a good feeling about them. Friend, ooh. Ooh, that's a uh, ooh. Ah, ee, 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 uh, ooh. Ooh. Mm. Huh. Ooh. Ah, that's a uh, ooh. Ah, yikes. Hmm. Oh, well, at least they clean up after themselves, right? Note to self. Wait, is there anything in there? Can I see anything in there? Uh, if there's anything in this room, other than the crazy rats, <laughs> like comment and subscribe and if there's not like comment and subscribe well I can't go in there anyway so like comment and subscribe if you thought that was pretty ironic that I couldn't even not kill directly couldn't even get in there anyway after I made that whole thing about liking comment and subscribing Those guys get focused on eating 
that, and also, I don't think they can go in the water. So, get dunked on. Battle. Close to hand holding for my life. Shaking my head. Disgusting. Demian's journal. Amanda and I only had enough coin for to buy half the elixir we needed. Even that's all gone now, and there's nothing left to do but wait. We're very sick, and there's no place above to hide from the city watch. They're breaking into houses all over our district, so we'll stay here and share the last hours together. Share the last hours together. I mean. Our fire will keep the rats away, but they'll inherit this city. Damien. Oh. Excuse me. I think that's very pessimistic. The outsider walks. Stuck. I'm not stuck. Don't Blocking the wheel. Get over there. Alright. Yeah, Colonel. Num nums. Down here. Not much of anything ever again. Maybe. Either way, let's just jump them down there. The rats. Quite rude, Lord Freya. But quite useful to me. that are behind you, and run away. Get dunked on. Attention Dunwall citizens. The assassin Corvo, responsible for the murder of our fair empress and the disappearance of Lady Emily, heir to the throne, has temporarily escaped state custody. What? Any evidence as to his whereabouts That guy must be super be cool and awesome and, and, can, and he could do anything if he managed to escape the prison after killing the Empress. No one will keep us from diat. <laughs> That's a weird word. What does diat mean? You cannot kill the rat plague. You can if you're not a pussy. Papa, money, money, money. I like money, eh? Excuse all the sniffles I'm doing. I'm like, I don't have allergies right now, and I'm trying to not do it as much. But it's really hard. And also, I think I'm kind of sick as well. So that's pretty epic. Disarm. I got a bolt. Disarm that as well. You know, it's not, it's not really disarming, it's more like you're triggering attack. That. That's a disarm. What I mean by it's not really disarm is when you just like. When you do that. It's not really a. You're just triggering it. It's not disarm. It's dad arm. <laughs> oh, I'm so funny. I am the funniest man alive. Oh, I fell in the hole. Hey! Gosh, it really is annoying having allergies. I'll, I'll tell you what. I, I tell you what. These 
are worth money, and those are money. Good morning, sir. Oh, I meant to pick you up, but... Cowabunga, dude. Uh, oh. Oh, can I... Sneeze. Keep trying to turn off my mic before I sneeze so that we're not... <laughs> Just sneezing right into the mic or whatever, but, you know. Oh yeah, what was I gonna do? Yeah. Cowbunga, dude! Epic. To the Lord Protector. Yeah. Greetings, Corvo. Or should I say Lord Protector, as you were known before that title was wrongfully taken from you. Yeah. We are servants of the Empire, of the true Empress. A group of loyalists who want very much to meet you. Yeah, take these weapons, crafted for you of the finest materials of the Isles, and meet with our man Samuel, near where the tunnels spill into Ren Renhaven River. Yeah, all haste and luck. We share a common purpose. Da -da, da -da, da -da, da -da, da That's a cool sword. Too bad we will not be using it. But it is old. Which is going to be our main projectile for this run through. Probably. Dunwall Sewer Gate Key. Press B to slide whilst sprinting. Ooh, that's called a sexy slide. Money, money, that's not money, that's food. In case you're too daft to remember, look to your whiskey for the answer. Whiskey, got it? If you want your share, you'll sort it out. If not, I'll come back for it next month. 451. 50 and, and the rest of this stuff is a junk. Here, don't worry about it. Don't worry about it. Don't worry about it. Nobody touched the safe. Nobody did. <laughs> the joke is that my name is nobody. That's what Corvo means in Italian. Oh. You don't know it's not. You're not gonna look you it up. You won't get past me, sir. Do you know who we're hunting here? Don't try to take them out alone. But what if no one from the squad is around? Then try to make a lot of noise when you die. Knock something over if you can. Bastard. Save the game, yeah. Smells like a dead weeper in here. That's just my farts, bitch. Now, to be honest, I don't think he comes back over here. So I'm pretty sure we're mostly safe. But, uh... I guess I'm just gonna try and put him... Right there. Because that's as out of the way as I can get him. While he's over here. Do a quick save. But not a quick save, because there is no quick save in this game. Well, I think there's probably a button key for it. Not button key. Uh, you know, a button that you can press for it. But on the keyboard, but I'm not using the keyboard. <sighs> I kind of want to knock these guys out and take their stuff, but... <sighs> I'm too much of a bitch. Wait. Oh, there's a third guy. Okay. Hmm. Let's save here. Shoot that guy. And then I knock you out. Oh. He didn't get knocked out. 
Uh, hold on. Huh, hold the phone. Hold the, hold the front door. <laughs> what if I just did this? That worked out better. knock my friend out here. Ooh, and that is how you do it. Uh, that is my 100% completion guide, part one uh, of 368. One part for every hour of the game, of course. Uh, and now we're done with the game. You're welcome. Everything else is just a uh, super easy, barely, uh, barely even a uh, thought. Dead Hermit's note. Okay, what do crabs sound like? It's here by the Renhaven. I'll make my last home. It stinks to the void, but my grandmum's hagfish stew will drive the odor away. I remember sailing out on this river to the great ocean. That vast, blinding light and blue water. I was a tender fifteen, and our nets were always full to burst in the old days. Before everything went to shit. Anyway it goes, it's either the boots of the watch against my skull, the teeth of the rats on my bones, or the trembles of the plague all over my skin. Don't matter none to me. Um, well, his body's not here, so he's probably okay. Uh, but I am robbing him. And also, his body's probably one of the many that we've come across all the time. Yep, yep, yep. Nailed it. Oh, I bet that's it anyway. God, these watch guys sleep like that. Just constantly sleep loud, snoring up a storm. Is it deep? Yeah, it's deep. Thanks for letting me know, Buster. Allegedly. The disappearance of Lady Emily, heir to allegedly. the has temporarily not escaped state custody. Not also Any not evidence as to his whereabouts must be delivered to the city watch at once. Corvo, over here. Quickly, I'm a friend. I'm Samuel. Hello, and I work Samuel. I want very much to meet you. They said you'd come out here. Whoa, whoa, wait I can whoa, still hardly believe it. I'll take you to meet them. Just down the river from here. Wait here. I need a moment first. Look around if you need. I'll be here. Just don't take too long. Now, I don't know... I'm pretty sure there's a note somewhere in the level that talks about it, but... I should just have to jump into here. And there's like a... Yeah, right here. There's like a chest right there. <laughs> All right. Get in. We've got a hot meal and a warm bed waiting for you. Let's -a go. All right, old man. Let's go. Hostiles killed? Zero. Civilians killed? Zero. Alarms rung? Zero. Dead or unconscious bodies found? <laughs> Zero. Overall chaos? Z low. Didn't kill anyone. But doom. Ghost never detected. But doom. Discovered the hermit's room. Open jelly safe. Found the sunken treasure. Boom, boom, boom. I didn't find all the coins, but I'm pretty sure a bunch were on the guards that I did not manage to murder. So, well, not murder. I know that I'm not murdering. I didn't, I didn't manage to knock him out. Ooh. Hidden allies. Hidden in an old bar on the river. Your new allies have plans to share with you. Meet with the loyalists inner circle to begin to learn what they've got in mind. This is the Hound Pits pub. Closed for Pounds business after the district marked off as dead from the plague. We're running.
right under the Lord Regent's nose, and he don't know a thing. It's a tall tower. You think he's compensating for something? Finds out what we're up to, <laughs> the watch will break in with swords drawn. And now that you've escaped, the Lord Regent's going to be tearing the city apart. I don't care. Take you up to meet Admiral Havelock and the rest of the warriors. The Admiral's a man to be reckoned with. If anyone can help you find that missing girl, Lady Emily, and clear your name, he can. Well, good, because that's all I care. I don't care about those spears yet. I need to save little M.M. Emmy Emmy. Emmy 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 Alright. I don't know. If there's any secret just fine right now. Probably is. If I have a hankering for a looking. But uh, I'm just leaving. Goodbye. Oh. Welcome to the Hound Pit Pub, sir. How may I help? Hello, sir. I am Wallace, and this is Cecilia. We have been informed of your arrival and will do our best to stay out of your way while you conduct your business. Yes. Lydia's a servant here as well. Is she sworn to carry my burdens? <laughs> Hey, or oh, sorry, I just. Ooh. Hey, mouse. Sorry about that. My mouse keeps falling. It's affecting the game. Uh, money, money, money. I'm exploring. Leave me alone. Oh, need a key for that. Poor Tenny sickness. No. Attention all citizens. Curfew extends from sundown to sunrise unless you are otherwise authorized. Violators will be subject to interrogation and <laughs> Workshop key needed. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. I'm still kind of exploring. Um, I can't climb any higher, so that's that. Where did I go? Oh. oh. Oh, I know where I am. Huh. Yeah, as if I'll go to there. So starting at last, we found our man. Even after six months in Cold Ridge Prison, he slipped out like it was nothing. Yes. Not surprising. He was the personal bodyguard of the Empress. You've heard the stories. Yes, I have. It still amazes me that someone could get to the Empress and young Lady Emily. No one knows the real story, Trevor. We all have our suspicions. We'll know the truth in time. He's strong and quick. But I hope he understands subtlety as well. This isn't one of your fancy hey. dress parties. The reality hey. is that we Of course I know subtlety. Kill. I got out of that prison have without a single person a knowing Only with noticing me. But it's a fair the bob was always. Well, that's your guy, your guy. He'll be oh. here soon, and I'm looking forward to meeting him. Okay. Uh, you guys have fun looking forward. Because I... I'm looking to the past, as in the past rulers that are probably on the coins, because that's how money works. They put a bunch of rulers on there. <laughs> but not the measurement kind! <laughs> river traffic not is me forbidden not from landing in the distillery district due to risk of infectious not the measurement kind. Violators <laughs> will be taken to the flooded <laughs> district for treatment Hello. and rehabilitation. My! You must be Corvo. I am Lydia, at your service. Are you your room sworn is to carry my burdens? When they told me who it was, well, I thought you'd be older, like the Admiral. Excuse me? Litany on the White Cliff! Except for a series of, of overseer invocations by High Overseer Abram Templeton. 
And I say to you, brothers, it is here that we make our stand as a righteous force against the growing darkness. It is here that we unite against the spirits of the unknown that would drag us screaming into the night, never to return to our homes, to our families. Together, we will serve as a rod to those who would stray from the herd, for the foggy gray wastes of the outsider. We will burn a bright fire with our virtuous actions, so that others will not lose their way. And to those who choose to wander beyond the hot walls of our homes in far places, We will strike at them swiftly, before they whisper to their neighbors, filling their hearts with strangeness and doubt. That was killer on my throat. Oh god, okay. Okay, you know what, I am running out of time for this episode, so I'm just gonna finish up this talk quick. And... We can continue this later, Lord Pendleton. The man of the hour is here. Corvo, Yo, mama? I'm Admiral Havelock. <laughs> a true servant of the Empire, like you. Until the Lord Regent purged those of us who wouldn't recognize his claim on the throne. And I'm Lord Trevor Pendleton. I represent the nobility in our little group. But we all act as equals here at the Hound Pits pub. This is a sure momentous occasion, Corvo. I'm going to come out with it. We've been building a coalition of loyalists. Aimed at ending the Lord Regent's tyranny and restoring the throne. At risk of execution, we're committed to finding young Lady Emily and seeing her crowned as Empress. We've got big plans, but we can't do any of it without you. We need your skills, your ability in a fight, and in helping us, we're going to help you destroy the men who murdered the Empress. So, ah. you must be exhausted. We can discuss this further after you've recovered, but before you retire, you should introduce yourself to Piero. He's challenging at times, but his industrious mind buys him that right. Oh yes, I'm sure. Yeah. Piero's as much an artist as a technician. He's going to be crafting the gear you'll need. Go talk to him, and then get some sleep. We can talk more when you've rested. Yes, sir. Be advised, the river crust infestation okay. is spread. Hold on. Yeah. Get fucked. Good morning. I'll be crafting your weapons and gear. All custom work. For you, I will create the tools of the master assassin. Including uh high key, low key, I don't know what key. No. Uh, the absolute whale oil mega coolest mask. Will you get a new tank from upstairs, please, while I hold this in place? Be careful. Maybe not all fiction, but it's a pretty cool mask. When it explodes, there's a terrible mess. Yes, yes, explosives, explosives. It's a cool mask. You can kind of see it, sort of, like, here. But obviously it's on the cover. And, you know, difficulty screens. Except from a series of newspaper articles from prominent natural philosophers by Piero Joplin. It is through no fault of my own that the average citizen has expressed preference for Sokolov's elixir over my own formula, sold as Piero's Remedy, a name I did not choose if you must know the truth. The public has spoken its usual message of idiocy, spending their coin as a means of selecting Sokolov's formula over mine, which I believe to be equal, if not superior. Much has been made of the popularity of these concoctions as a means of resisting this remarkable new plague. I say remarkable because this strain works with an efficiency we have not seen in the history of the Empire. This plague, now making its way through the city of Dunwall, is unrivaled in its effectiveness. I have studied it within the blood of those so afflicted, and it is nearly perfect, elegant, in fact. And while it is true that Piero's remedy and Sokolov's elixir are known to protect the body against the plague equally, my own has properties not fully understood which relate to the mind itself and the spirit. And it is in this way that my formula wins out. Here is where one should pay attention to the contest. To this contest. For you see, Sokolov's elixir, with its emphasis on the brute animal body, is a cross better suited for livestock. 
Crasku, maybe. The subtle and secret variants in the key ingredients making up Piero's remedy ensure that it works on the higher functions that separate humankind from the mindless, blue-jawed hagfish swimming in the Red Haven River. Interesting. So Mr. Piero has a high opinion of himself. Hey, what's that? Star chart. Oh. Money. Sweet. Piero's rest man. Now, I will not sign off on these purchases. A bag of powdered crystal, Tivian ore. What's wrong with the metals and crystal? King Sparrow Feathers. King Sparrow Feathers? If you need feathers, sacrifice your own pillow. Maybe at the Academy, everything you needed was paid for by tariff and handed out willy-nilly. But this is my bar, or what's left of it. And we're operating on a budget. We're running low on oil, food, elixir, building materials, and everything else. So you've got to slow down. While I'm footing the bill, I will not approve your purchases unless they're absolutely required. No more copper wire or special herbs. If you need those things, go out and scavenge them. Half the city's in ruins, so no one's going to miss any of the odd crap you seem to need. Admiral Hef Heiflock. Um, I'm going to throw this out the window. A new tank. Hmm. What an interesting symbol. Whale vivisection. Remarkably, each specimen I had the pleasure of studying during the, during the voyage possessed some minor variants in physiology. On the second leg of the trip, beast of Tivia, the crew all aboard a female, some 42 foot in length. I estimate you weight 35 tons, and the ship sat low, rocking side to side through the night with her thrashing. By candlelight, I took her apart, sketching and taking notes. Against her bellowing, I cut into the mass tentacles around her mouth. Within, I found row upon row of teeth and a baleen running along the upper jaw. Through, through this broom-like structure, I assumed she filtered food from the water that was small to be chewed. <sighs> Out at sea, I secured a beast with hooks with lines that cast from the main ship and from several smaller boats. Buoys keep the whale from diving deep. Once it's caught, a larger hook is driven through the tail, which is used to hoist the creature up through the chute. They moan and bellow for some time as the men get them onto deck, then lift them into the scaffolding overhead. The ship adjusts its prow and returns to port in Nanwal, where the crew works on the great creature, slicing off the fattiest parts while it still lives. Oh, good. Not at all weird. Or creepy. Whale oil refilling station. Sokolov no longer has the upper hand with regards to the supply of whale oil. The good admiral has paid for the installation of my own system, which will enable me to work in this place. The oil tank dispenser, when activated, will produce an empty vessel for filling. When the empty tank is held near the oil tank refill pump, the magnetic attractor should take the tank and lock it in the correct configuration. Using the lever will begin the refilling process. Once refilling is completed, the tank can be removed and placed in service. Extreme caution must be used in handling the full tanks. They are quite unstable. The system is sound and well engineered. It appears that the Greaves Oil Company has done something correctly for once. <sighs> Good job! Pressure in the cold are too much to endure without it. I speculate that a human being might, by a process of adaptation, produce high energy humors in the body. I could build a tank that would slowly increase pressure on a subject over a long period of time and then observe them for years if need be mm -hmm. to see if the formulation of energetic substances developed. Surely the Empress would be able to furnish me with facilities, subject to the necessary legal amnesty. Piero, I'm gonna be honest, you're kind of a weirdo. 
You know what I mean? Like low key. Absolute freakazoid. Hey, how many tanks can I get? You know, if I just had to. How did that happen? Uh, I have no idea, sir. <laughs> Oops. <laughs> Oops. Did I do that? You lost your mind. Uh, speed run. <laughs> Fastest speed run I've ever done. Perfect. Now plug it in. Here you go, Creepazoid. <laughs> Perfect. Thank you, Cole. De nada. Here, see? <laughs> That's Italian for front doors. You're a wanted man, so everyone in the city knows your face. But this mask will mean terror to them. If you just hold still, fit must be precise. There. Can you see normally? It's like I'm at the icon. Lens out of alignment. There. Better now? I could create more for you. Upgrades for your gear, weapons, munitions. But our situation here is desperate. Scavenge the city for valuables, and I will resell them on the black market. That should give us the money to craft the things you need. Sounds Tell me good. what I can make for you. Alright. I take a look. I take a look. I take a look. Okay. Mm -hmm. So I don't, I mean. There we go. You must be exhausted. I advise that you get some sleep. Make Your life me. will get even more difficult soon. You should rest while you can. All right, all right. Very well. You know best. Let me know if you need anything more. Yes, sir, Bobby. I just don't want to get teleported. I want to walk all the way. Like a real person. I'm a man. Yes, very much so, but no need to fear. He is here to work with our master. People say he killed the Empress. Of course he didn't. <laughs> People are foolish and believe whatever they're told. Okay. If the Admiral trusts him, then so will I. You guys talking about me? Please follow me to your quarters. Hmm. Kind of sounds like, but he probably isn't. Mr. Uh, Sam Whitware, who's in Star Wars. Oh, he's in a lot of things. But remember him from Star Wars The Force Unleashed? The best Star Wars game, Loki. I'm a real man. One of those kick butts. Corvus Chamber. This is your room. It was chosen to give you privacy. I understand you'll need your rest. Indeed. Uh, now get out. Out, I say. Okay, I can get up further from the tower. Uh huh, okay. At the end of every year, after the last day of the month of songs, we begin the Fugue Feast. New Year has not started, and thus the time that follows is outside the calendar. Huh? A period of celebration and feasting begins, during which the people abandon the very practices that keep them whole and healthy over the year. Many leave their homes, euphoric with spirits or patent or potent herbs. Oh, they are my good kush. Some paint their faces or wear masks to conceal themselves as they pursue their passions without reservation. 
When the right cosmological signs are observed, and it is time for the calendar to begin anew, the sitting high overseer calls for the hymn of atonement, and the fugue feast ends. Families return to their homes, wives to their husbands, enemies put down their weapons, and fires are extinguished. No complaint is given for those who have wronged others, deviated from ancient codes, or discarded oaths, for this is the time during the astrological alignment does not exist and is not recorded. The following day starts a new year, marked on the first day of the month of Earth, as it has always been. So it's like the perch. I get it. Oh my god, When the child shows the proper inclination, he is marked. Overseers are assigned to study the subject surreptitiously in order to determine whether the inclination is supported by cosmological conditions and other signs ongoing throughout the year. At the end of the cycle, those befitting further testing are removed from the host <sighs> some hours before dawn and must begin the march to outpost to an outpost outside the city. There the children undergo ritual preparation and evaluation until the last day of the month of rain when they make a pilgrimage to White Whitecliff. During an elaborate ceremony, it is determined which of the children will become overseers and which must be put down. How very fun. Ugh. My stomach twisted as the engines of the odd vessel roared louder. It was the creation of Orchado, the third prefect from the Academy of Natural Philosophy. He was exhilarated, savoring each of the small craft's undulations. Ochado, Pearl Deva, and a great gout go of smoke surrounded us. The smell of burning whale oil grew unbearable as the machine propelled itself upward. I was too afraid to look out the window, which suddenly didn't feel thick enough. As if knowing my thoughts, Overseer Brian looked at me and smiled. Recite some of the litany, my pupil. It will protect your heart from the turpentide, the turp turp turpitude of the void on our way to the outer sphere. Obviously. Uh, right. Yo, what the fuck were you doing in my room? Go in there again without my friction, and I'm going to gut you. I'm sorry it's so dark. We can't risk being seen. It is a bit romantic, though, isn't it? I would like to... I used to be the hostess here. Oh, I could tell you stories about that, believe me. All right. Does it involve you staying the fuck out of my room? Okay. Uh, is there anything over here? Uh, I know. Just the exit. What does that say? Blood from the eyes. Obvious. Mine. Alright, well, I'm gonna call it a day right here before going to bed uh, in the game. Uh, I have to go to bed in the real life. Uh, I hope you enjoyed episode one of oh, that's of Dishonored. Uh, and because I did, yeah, like, comment, and subscribe, or don't. You know, it's it's really up to you in the end. Uh, yeah. See you <laughs> next time.